coming up next, I'm going to give my thoughts and opinions on one of the classics, Aqua di Gio, EDT, Eau de Toilette, from Armani. I'll let you know what I think. Stay tuned. So everybody, thank you for tuning in today. My name is Joel, Joel the Nose. And today I'm just gonna do a quick video. It's not even really necessarily a, a full review video, but just my thoughts on Aqua de Gio, uh, Eau de Toilette, the EDT. This is the 100 milliliter bottle. Um, you know, this is something that, you know, look, everyone reviews, everyone talks about. Probably everybody out there who's watching this video has in their collection. I have it in my collection. I don't have a ton of, uh, I guess, designer fragrances anymore. I've, almost everything that I buy is niche because I like to be different. I like to stand out. I like to wear, just whether it be my clothes, my my thoughts, uh, my artwork, different things that I do. I like to, to be an individual. So my thoughts on, on Aqua Di Gio is, you know, I've had this bottle for over 10 years now. And look, you can see that it is barely barely used. And why is that? Right from the beginning when I bought this, okay? I bought it, I don't know, I think around 2010. And, you know, of course you go into any department store, it's one of the ones that's first out. It's, you know, highly recommended, you know, by any of the, you know, people, the salespeople. And when I initially smell it, I gotta say, it, you know, it's obviously very pleasant. There's a reason why this is one of the best selling fragrances of all time, Alberto Mar Marias is, you know, a classic perfumer, one of the, you know, giants of the industry. But, you know, my my feeling in this is, you know, it's definitely kind of got that citrusy, musky, marine scent. I mean, I, you don't have to break this down into going to a thousand uh, little uh, note analyses. That's what you get from this. And that's, it's very pleasant. I like marine scents. I'm here in South Florida. I'm, I surf. I was surfing all weekend, actually, this week with uh, her, Hurricane. Isaias, which was just, uh, came by us. So I love the smell. I love the smell of the salt, the ocean. Uh, but as an EDT, as you can expect, you're not going to get a lot of, lo you know, longevity on this. So this thing lasts only about three hours. And really after the first hour, that kind of marine salty scent is gone. Um, you know, I, I don't get a ton of citrus in it. Also the dry down for me is kind of weak. And my biggest problem with this is it's maybe it's because of its own success. Why do you want to smell like everybody else? Uh, you know, why do you want to wear the same clothes? To me, it's like, okay, something that maybe was great at one time, but, you know, for example, I love pizza, but if I eat pizza literally every single day and everyone else around me ate it, I'd probably get really bored of it. And, and to me, this is something that's still, unfortunately, man, when I walk around here in Miami, it's like people, I just smell this constantly still. And I just don't understand why you'd want to smell like everybody else. I don't care if it's popular. I don't care if you think it's good. You may think it's it's great, you know, and, and I'm sure most people do. Uh, but I don't know. Just my personal opinion, guys, is do something to smell a little bit different. Find something unique. Find something that's, you know, going to set you apart and make you stand out from everybody else. And, and that's my problem with Aqua de Gio. It's why I've barely used it over all these years. To be honest with you, I never really got great um, from the ladies whenever they smelled it. No one really seemed to like it so much on my skin. Again, I re reacts different with, differently with everybody. So, but even so, I don't care. Even if this was reacted great, I'm not going to smell like every other dude out there. So, just my opinion. Be different, guys. Try something new. Try something different. And uh, let me know what you guys think. This is Joel the Nose, and I will talk to you guys later.